This is a Tesla Model S, a classic, uh, I think, it's 85? Yeah. Okay, it's a classic 85 from 2014. And you know, it's before the, the older Pilot came out. So, um, well, you have some lead bars and stuff here, but you see that it doesn't have the radar. But this, ca this car has um, what I would call a, an aftermarket autopilot uh, equipment. So, um, uh, basically, I think if you go in the, on the, on that side, so you, so you have, you have <laughs> so uh, yeah, let's, let, can you show me? So we have some stuff inside here. This is where the magic happens. Oh, so over there. This is the uh, open pilot uh, system. So it, it controls the car. Uh, it's called the uh, Eon. Okay. And, uh, uh. Um, so th that's the camera, like the AP-1 camera. Okay. Uh, instead of having the camera integrated to the windshield, we just mount this uh, phone here. Which is a phone? Yeah, huh? this is in uh, OnePlus 3, I think. Okay. Uh, and uh, we ran a USB cable here and uh, over to the uh, ODB plug under here. And uh, I plug it into a, what they call a panda and a giraffe and then uh, those units uh, talk to the car, so uh, I'll have self-controlling car. Uh, also, uh, we have to run a cable from the ODB devices down there to the um, E-Pass, so we can kill the signals uh, that this car... Oh, yes, so you see here, we have some extra cables. Uh, only, only the uh, uh, grey one here. Is that, uh, is that a Cat 6 cable? Yeah, basically. Okay. Uh, it's not a Cat 6, but you can it's use a, a Cat 6. Okay. Yeah. And that's connected to devices under there. And uh, uh, we, we can't see it uh, because I have my front uh, mounted, but uh, basically the cable runs over there and goes down uh, under here and to the uh, uh, control unit e pass okay. un under the front here. Huh, interesting. Uh, but can you show me autopilot then? Yeah, let's try it. Okay, we are now on the highway and uh, we're gonna test that autopilot stuff. So, uh, you just, just activate it. And you see the display here, it looks like uh, the one with AP, so it's been, uh, you can say it's been hacked to work like the AP1 cars, right? Yeah. Uh, so we gained uh, root access or admin access to the car, so we can uh, change the config of the car so it will display the uh, autopilot UI for us using the uh, uh, can messages we send to the car from the uh, uh, phone in the window. But this is a bit interesting because we are following that truck and we don't have radar. So this thing... Uh, currently uh, I'm controlling the speed because... Oh, you but I can activate the uh, adaptive cruise control and now I'm not doing the speed at all. Oh, there, there, okay. Yeah. Now you have the, oh, that's weird. <laughs> so you actually, you actually use auto steer without uh, And adaptive. the car is, is doing that itself. So okay. in, it knows the speed is 110 and it will try to follow the, and now you can see it's kind of close to the, uh, Okay. it's braking by itself, but Again, this is a visual uh, adaptive cruise control, so it's kind of buggy. Uh, so when I get the radar installed, it will be just like the AP-1. Oh yeah, so you can actually add the radar and then... Yeah, you can use it without radar. So the only thing you need is the phone in the window and uh, a few devices in the ODB port and uh, that's it. And a cable, of course, to the E-Pass. So, so this, is, uh, this uh, costs about... Uh, uh, 15,000 Norwegian kroners uh, to do the full install like I've done. So uh, radar is another, uh, I don't know what they're going for, but I think a couple of thousand kroners more and you'll have the radar. So it's huh? uh, at least cheaper to do this than uh, installing the full uh, AP uh, hardware and uh, software. Yeah, okay, and I noticed something. You're, you're yeah. not holding the steering wheel. No. So you don't have that uh, 15 second nag you have in the... Oh, not at all. I can drive from Oslo to Drammen without uh, touching the steering wheel at all. So, uh, yeah, I maybe noticed it one time where I 
might have needed to touch the steering wheel, but yeah, I don't need to touch it uh, like the uh, autopilot uh, software in the Nex. And that's quite nice. Yeah, this is, uh, it that just shows you that, you know, the car is capable of driving itself without any user inputs. <laughs> yeah. It's not, I mean, the reason why we have to touch a steering wheel in the modern car is because of regulations. Yeah. But the car can do it just fine. Oh, they, okay. So now it's not following the car. As you can see it, uh, on the uh, top left there, there's no max set. So that was, you can have, there's three kind of modes. Uh, now it's, uh, I'm controlling the speed and the car is uh, controlling the steering. Uh, or the uh, open pilot uh, and uh, we can pull it one more time and now it's cruise control without adaptive cruise control uh, so I have to brake now that we're getting close to the truck in front and double tap and it's adaptive cruise control so there's three kinds of uh, open pilot uh, hmm. steering interesting yeah it's called open pilot there's a whole community yeah uh, about this also, uh, since we're on it, uh, you can see here that we're, since we have a root access to the car, we can uh, change the um, translation files in the system. So uh, we have changed a few uh, things there. So it's not. This is a. You, you guys, I mean, someone just created a new menu. No, it's the same menu as Open uh, or uh, Autopilot, but we changed the translation files oh, to say Open, open. Pilot. Yeah. <laughs> I see. Okay. That was that was interesting. A oh, little yeah. different. <laughs> <laughs> so um, yes, it is possible to add Autopilot in existing cars in old cars. Yeah, so at least if you don't want to buy a new one, then you can even keep the old one and just add a little bit of stuff and then it will actually work Yeah, as good as AP1, right? Yeah, uh, at least when I install the radar, it's uh, as good as the AP1. Nice, yeah. nice. Okay, cool. Uh, thank you so much for the demonstration. No problem at all. <laughs> yeah. So I guess you can just, I can try to find some links with you, you can just search for it, uh, open, what's yeah, it? Yeah, okay. open pilot, open I can pilot. give you some links. Yeah. Okay, yeah. thank you. So I think that's it for now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, as always, thank you for watching and talk to you later.